Sports Crosswits. And here's your host, Tom O'Connor. What a welcome. You cheers just as if you'd done it before. <laughs> and yet we've never met. Wonderful people in the audience. Are you well? Yes. You look grand. You look good at home as well. And let's have a look at the people who are going to play the game. We have Andrew Marriott. Hi, hi Andrew. Hi, Tom. Where, where are you from, sir? I'm from Hull. From Hull, in lovely Yorkshire. And you're a parcel delivery office worker. Uh, something like that. I'm the bloke who treads on the ones called fragile. Oh, is it you step on them? <laughs> well, <laughs> well, of course, that keeps keeps an interest of course and and you owned you once owned a dog which was a very handy uh, animal to have wasn't it Tell it us was why. indeed yeah it was great for parking because it was the most mild-mannered beautiful lovely dog you could ever want to meet until you put it in front of a traffic warden and it turned into Cujo <laughs> vicious with a traffic warden and, and it frightened everyone and you never you never got a parking ticket did you never in my life left the, just left the dog by the car <laughs> <laughs> A long time ago, when I lived in a different place to where I am now, we, uh, we had a, a charity uh, night and we, we had a big raffle to raise money for a little handicapped boy. And our local traffic warden gave us a prize in the raffle, three months free parking. So if you give us your number, I won't book your car for three months if you were there. Isn't that lovely? That's very nice. She's been sacked since then. Anyway, Kim, <laughs> Kim Hartman, ladies and gentlemen, is our partner. Give her a warm welcome. You're welcome, Matt, dear. And, of course, up to now, we have not mentioned her flick, who I think on a couple of occasions might have been handy for you. Could yes, have been I think it would have been, yeah. A bit, bit more useful than... Uh... Than my brain. Well, I don't know. You, you, you've had a couple of leaps up and down, haven't you? Well, yes, a few moments of high excitement. Yes. Lots of moments of high anxiety. Yes. Yes. But other than that, you've done nothing, basically. Oh. <laughs> Part partners have done all the work and you've just sat there and gone, me, occasionally. <laughs> Every now and then. Every I'll now and then. Just brighten <laughs> things just up. Just do it. Yeah, I'm just it. Bye, Joe. All right. <laughs> well, will we get more weeks today? We'll see. First of all, let's meet the opposition. We have Ali Williams. Hi, Ali. Hello, Tom. You're from Snodland. That's right. Not a lot of people in Snodland, is there? <laughs> <laughs> and is, is that in Kent, apparently? It is, yeah. Okay. First of all, you play snooker. I do. There aren't many ladies who are that keen. And you can, you're better than your husband, is that right? Yeah, he's most put out because he taught me how to play and I can actually beat him now. Oh, there you are. <laughs> have you got a table yourselves or no? You just no, play... no. We just play at the local working men's club. Well done, well done. And I'm talking about working, you're a registered general nurse. That's right. All oh, right. And uh, I mean, it's a wonderful job, and I know you've got lots and lots of stories, because nurses always, they always get the worst of it. I love nurses, you see, because nurses are the only people in the, in the entire world who can actually say, take all your clothes off, we want to look at your eyes. <laughs> <laughs> They're wonderful. And you had an experience when you were, you were training as a nurse with the Queen Alexander Royal Army Nursing Corps. That's right which is Quaranx. Yeah. That's right. And they're out running. She's only 18. They're out running, right? And a lorry driver pips his own, you know. So what, what did you do? I gave him a wave. Gave him a wave. You know, when you're running with the army, <laughs> like, all in order. You know, big, big, big. Hello. <laughs> Been mother job. So what happened? The sergeant was most put out and maybe do ten press-ups in the centre of the roundabout. See? <laughs> As a punishment. Strappy old sergeant. And rightly so, if you don't mind my <laughs> So nurses waving at lorry drivers. Whatever next. Whatever next. They'll be, they'll be partnering George Layton next. That's what will happen here. George Layton, ladies and gentlemen, our special celebrity guest. A man who has won very few things in his life, but so far two games on the run and one toss. It's a turn-up for the book, isn't it? It is. You. Right. You, you're not, you, you haven't quite learned to cope with it yet, have you? I haven't. I haven't. I mean, he's it's trying to look shock. humble now and he can't. Well, but we're going for a... You know, full house. The holiday. Yeah. It's the holiday. This, yeah, is, this is the one. This is the holiday. This will, you'll, you'll enjoy it. It's a beautiful holiday. I've seen where it is. It's great. Snodland. So, <laughs> we will play the game. Who, ha who has won the toss? They lost it. They lost it. So, therefore... We've won it. You're starting. <laughs> OK. You're starting. Let's have a look at the first puzzle of the day. It looks like this. And we're looking, for, obviously, for the answers. But the link between the answers is the keyword. We have a clue word, which is inquiry. And there are three words in the keyword. Three words. Ali and George. Three down, please. A bit like Belmont, only more masculine. Mm -hmm. Andrew and Kim? Um, uh, three down. Put my glasses on. A bit like Belmont, only more masculine. Beaumont. Beaumont, yes. Bow and Bell. Well done. I don't know why I showed surprise, really. Ali and George. <laughs> Four across, please. He was the organ of Under Milk Wood, Captain. Thomas. No, it wasn't Thomas. All right, Andrew and Kim. 
You'll try one down. Turbot hamper conceals beefy chap. Botham. Botham. Turbot and hamper include the word Botham. And beefy, of course, fine sportsman. All round sportsman, in fact. Ali and George? Five across, please, Tom. Mindless imitator learns things in this fashion, we hear. Go on. Parrot. Parrot. Parrot fashion. <laughs> and the buzz is gone. Three words, and they are? Oh, I was going to say Ian. Yeah. What were you going to say? I was going to say Ian, but it's not three words, it's only three letters. Oh, as in Ian Bowman and Ian Parrot. <laughs> <laughs> and it, but, I've got the right yeah, partner this week. I was just going to say, you're reading my mind there. <laughs> right, it wasn't that, I'm ashamed, uh, I'm ashamed to say, Ali, but a good try. Uh, Andrew and Kim? Yes. Four across, please, Tom. He was the organ of Under Milkwood Captain. It was that one. No, Ali and George? Uh, two down, please. One's over a barrel like Arthur Gilly. Cooper. Cooper. Yes, Cooper works on the barrels. We're in now. And the three words are... It's a three, three words, isn't Three it? words. Is it famous sports personalities? Uh, famous sports... No. That's four, anyway, isn't it? But famous sports no, it's personalities? No, it's three. It says three, but, it, but it, no, it isn't that. Oh, right. that is, they may be, but that's not the link, I'm afraid. Right. So, Andrew and Kim. Yes. Try four um, across, please, Tom. He was the organ of Under Milkwood Captain... Morgan. Morgan, the organ. And the buzz is gone. Andrew's on to it, he thinks it's... Question of sport. Exactly Captain. right. Well played. <laughs> they were all captains on Question of Sport. The missing link at two across was going to be Carson. So he had Willie Carson, Cliff Morgan, Bill Beaumont, Beaumont Henry Cooper, Ian Botham and John Parrott. But apparently they all had Ian as their second name, Ali, so you were very close. <laughs> but a good round, we got all the points. Ali and George have 13, Andrew and Kim have 13. <laughs> OK. Move on to the musical puzzle, here it comes, musical round. Puzzle looks like this, clue word says gangway. We are looking for two words, two words song title. Andrew and Kim. Okay. One down, please, Tom. The state of mamas and papas dreaming. California. California dreaming <laughs> on such a winter day. Alan George? Three across, please. Oh, Zara in such a state. Oh, Zara in such a state. Arizona? Arizona. Oh, Zara and in makes Arizona. Well done. Andrew and Kim? Six across. Six across. No cuts organised for city near Phoenix. Tucson. Tucson, yes. Tucson, Arizona. No cuts. Harry and George? Uh, four down, please. Abandoned bank in Paris. Left? The left bank, and you abandon it when it's left. <laughs> well played. Andrew and Kim? Two down, please, Tom. Little Joseph twice would be a yo-yo in Sweden. Jojo? Jojo would be a yo-yo. So, Ali and George, you're left with five across. Yeah. House, E.T. called it. Sorry? Home. Home, home yes. Yeah. House and home. Any words in the song? There are two, there are two words. Have a look at it. Press your buzzer and tell me what they are. They are what? Two, one, it's gone. Andrew and Kim. Andrew's got it. Get back. It's get back. Oh. Jojo was a man who thought he was a woman, but he was a man. Jojo left his home in Tucson, Arizona. It's Beatles one, a great song as well. So there we are. Get back brings the points up this way. Ali and George have 28, but Andrew and Kim have 60. <laughs> as we rush on to the mystery round, here comes the mystery puzzle. No clue where, of course, because hopefully, hopefully, not, not so far in this run, but hopefully one of them is going to give me one correct answer, guess the keyword, and win this cordless telephone. So, could it be the third game? Lucky, we'll see. Who's leading? Andrew and Kim. One across. It's hard cheese for the family Robinson. Swiss. Swiss cheese. Swiss family Robinson. <laughs> now, <laughs> press your buzzer and tell me what the link is with Swiss. It will be? Swiss roll. It is Swiss roll. Well done. Woo, <laughs> 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 a telephone. They are, in fact, all rolls. Some more, obviously, not, than others. Four was an Eskimo roll. Do we know what that is? 
afternoons. Yeah, nice That's right. Uh, six was going to be a bridge roll, two was sausage That's roll, fun. three was drum roll, and five would have been Vienna roll. You picked a good one there with Swiss. Okay, no. So well done, you've won a telephone. It means Ali and George stay on 28. Andrew and Kim have 75. <laughs> Has the wheel finally come off George's bike? We'll know <laughs> after this break. See you then. <laughs> Playing the anagram round right now. Here's the anagram puzzle. Looks like this, and the clue word says Morse. And we're looking for an anagram made up of the first letter of all six answers. And Ali and George are trailing, but not very many, but they're going to go first. Uh, love one down, please, Tom. Foreigners, this type can't stand them. Strangers? Nope. Andrew and Kim? One down, please, Tom. Foreigners, this type can't stand them. Xenophobe. Xenophobe. Well done. <laughs> worth about 400 at Scrabble, that one, isn't it? Yeah. <laughs> Ali and George. Uh, for six across. How many footballers run like babies? Dribblers. Yeah, yeah. well... Dribbler. No, dribbler. 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 Dribble. 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 Go on. <laughs> you kept talking. <laughs> and the pity overcame me. Andrew and Kim. I've just moved on. Oh, oh, right. Just moved on. Mm -hmm. So, Andrew Kim. Yes, five across. A character between Mortimer and McKern. Rumpole. It is. The writer and the actor. <laughs> Ali and George. Four down, please, Tom. The waste of the permafrost. Ooh, I know, I sat up. Big words for me. I tell they you. are big words. I know, another big word. Huge. <laughs> 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 Andrew and Kim. Four down, please. The waste of the permafrost. Tundra. The tundra wastes. Oh, they're in. They're in. And we think it is? Dexter. It is Dexter. Well played. <laughs> Three across would have been esteem and two would have been embalmed. Do you know why the, the link was Morse? He wrote it, didn't he? He wrote uh, yeah. Inspector Morse. Well done. Well played. Good round, that. And Ali and George have 35 points now, but Andrew and Kim have 107. <laughs> So let's move back to a normal round. Here comes a normal puzzle. The clue word says couple, and we are looking for three words in the keyword. A three-word keyword, Andrew and Kim. One down. Yeah, one down. Worthing in confusion over what's done with wellies. Throwing. Throwing. If you shovel <laughs> worthing around, you get throwing the wellies. Ali and George. Three cross, please. Medical officer sped around on such bikes. Doctor? No. Would have fitted to. Andrew and Kim? Let's try three across, please, Tom. Medical officer sped around on such bikes. Mopeds. Mopeds, the M-O, and sped around. <laughs> Ali and George? Two down, please. Parking beside Old Ark, you'll see Cornish man Ross. Andrew and Kim? Two down, please, Tom. He's picking them all up, isn't he? Parking beside Old Ark, you'll see Cornishman Ross. Old Ark. Old Ark. P for par parking. <laughs> and Old Ark. <laughs> Ali and George? Very good. Um, yeah, um, sit five across, please. One takes a regular hammering from Smith. Anvil? Anvil is right. Well done. <laughs> Andrew and Kim? Six. 
Six across. About a rumble in the jungle, even. Fight. A fight. It is a fight. It's about, and a rumble in the jungle was a fight as well, Muhammad Ali. <laughs> so, Ali and George, you have four down, four down to yeah. find. DA leaves cop car to find South American pipes. DA? Mm -hmm. Leaves cop car. Pan. Pan, yes. Panda, take the DA away. Yeah. Pipes of pan. Ali and George are in control. I'm looking for three words, please. Keyword, what is it? Press your buzzer. Couple is a good, a good uh, clue, by the way. No answer? Okay. Andrew and, Jim, uh, Andrew and Kim? It is? Reeves and Mortimer. Reeves and Mortimer or Vic and Bob we had. Two fine entertainers, and of course, these are all the, the sketches. They have Poldak on, motor, on mopeds, anvil throwing, and pan fighting. There they are. Vic and Bob, Reeves and Mortimer, well done. Great score there. Ali and George have 43. Andrew and Kim have 143. <laughs> Watch this space for the all-time comeback. Let's move to another round. Here it is. The puzzle looks like this. Clue word says curry. Two words and a keyword. Andrew and Kim. Try one down, please, Tom. Such intelligence can't be for real. Artificial. Yes, artificial intelligence. Well done. <laughs> Ali and George. Six across. Virtual illusion that seems genuine. Reality. Yes. Very good. And the boss has gone two words, huh? Oh. No, I was thinking of one word. Intelligence. Oh, no, I thought you were going to say Ian again. <laughs> <laughs> Andrew and Kim, then. Five across, Five. please, Tom. Space station returns to French Sea for endless trimmers. <laughs> Bit obscure, this one. Ali and George? Three down, please. Endless blisters for inventor of antiseptic. Lister. Lister, indeed. <laughs> Take the ends off blisters, you get Lister. Andrew and Kim? Two across, please, Tom. Ivy's partner in song and piano star, Miss Hunter. Holly. Holly. The Holly and the Ivy and Holly Hunter. <laughs> Holly and George? Four across. Act around like Rex or Ragdoll. Cat. Cat. Yes, well done. You jumble, <laughs> act around, and you get cat. So, Andrew and Kim, we've only got five across. Space station returns to French sea for endless trimmers. Rimmer? Rimmer it is. It's Rimmer. <laughs> the audience obviously do not believe it. The space station is Mir, M-I-R. Yeah. You turn it backwards and put it to a French sea, which is M-E-R. Rimmer and endless trimmers. Take T and S on. Yeah, now, the there's all the words. Nobody's words. pressed the buzzer. Andrew words and Kim are in charge. We're looking for two words in the keyword. Press your buzzer. What can it be? It's... Curry is a very good clue. No? We move across. Ali and George? Red Dwarf. It is. Well done. It's Red Dwarf. I'm coming back! <laughs> <laughs> Holly is the computer, Cat... Yeah, we know, get on with the game. Thank you. <laughs> Artificial reality machine is one of the episodes, and curry is because Craig Charles's character loves curry as food. Right, I'm, I'm doing as I'm told, moving on swiftly. Here comes the next puzzle, looks like this. Clue word says beer, and it's, it's two words again, this one. Andrew and Kim. Three down, please, Tom. Continental cars belonging to President Abe. Lincoln's. Lincoln, Lincoln Continentals. <laughs> Lovely car. Five across. Ali and George? Five across, please. It's found on Curly Shirley's brow. Curly Shirley's brow. Temple. Yes, her temple's on her brow. <laughs> Andrew again. Four across, please, Tom. Man in between wholesaler and retailer. Middle. Middleman. <laughs> Ali and George. One, One down, down, please. This select circle won't start dinner. Inner. Inner circle. Oh. Well done. <laughs> Andrew and Kim. Six across. Munch on the grass like aliens, we hear. Mm -hmm. 
Are you George? Say it again. Munch on the grass like aliens, we hear. Choose. Not choose. Mm -hmm. Andrew and Kim? Yeah, we'll try two across, Tom. Like Chaucer's tabard, it had no room for Mary. In. in. The tabard in. <laughs> Ali and George, you're back to munch on the grass like aliens, we hear. Yeah, munch on the grass. No. No offers? Mm -hmm. Andrew and Kim? Munch on the grass like aliens, we hear. No? So, fingers on the buzzers, extra clue. Here we go. Now, if cows munch on grass, we put them out to? Yes? Graze. Graze, that's right. We put them out to graze. <laughs> and, oh, and I was going to say, in sci-fi, uh, the greys are aliens. That's where we got the, the other thing. We, you've missed everything. All the clues should have led you, in fact, to court inns. They are inns of court, greys in, Lincoln's in, inner temple, middle temple. And, and the beer was a clue to inn. It didn't matter because the game is all over and Ali and George have not won, but they have 80 points. Amazingly, though, Andrew and Kim have 186. <laughs> So, Ali, you had to do ten press-ups for waving at a, a lorry driver. George will do about 4,000. For losing. In the town hall square for letting you down. All right, yeah. never mind. A goodly game. Ali, you have our two books and our thanks. And I'll, and I'll have to Snodland. Yes, when you I'll get take there. it. Good girl. And thank you, George. Oh, enjoyable oh. as ever. Oh, because it's always exciting no matter I'm, what you do. I'm going home a part winner, really, aren't I? Uh, yes, a part, yes, a true. Part winner. winner. Yes, yeah. I suppose. A studio winner, I suppose. Yes. It. Okay. So hopefully now Andrew and Kim are going to win a holiday. We could do with one. Be a full house. Got the phone already. Fingers crossed for you. Here's the puzzle. Ten clues. Sixty seconds. Choose a clue. One across, please, Tom. It'll shoot you. Snap out of it. Camera. Yes. One down, please. An old boiler with Macbeth's witches. Cauldron. Yes. Two down. A wet or dry creature. Amphibian. Yes. Four across. He blows at a Scottish tattoo. Piper. Piper. Yes. Five down. Get by with Magnus Magnuson. Pass. Yes. Three down. The swimming stroke for yes men. Crawl. Yes. Eight across. The herb of faulty Puzzle. towers. Yes. Seven down. A black time for shift workers. Night. Yes. Six across. A boat or its inauguration. Launch. Yes. And nine across. The mass you hear at a wedding. Nuptial. Yes. Yeah! Well, you did it so coolly, other than Kim having to be scraped off the ceiling. You were so cool. <laughs> and I looked and I thought, they've still got 13 seconds, and it was like, bum, 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 well played. Hey. Well, you have a telephone uh, already, Andrew, and now you're going on a holiday for two to Tenerife. Oh. Oh. He's going on holiday, Kim's going away, but you will return, won't you, dear? I certainly will. Please yes. do. And until we see Kim again, and in fact, until we see you again, take care of yourselves and never cross word. All right, bye bye. If you'd like to pitch your wits on Crosswits, please write to this address. Crosswits, Tyne Tees Television, P.O. Box 1AL, Newcastle upon Tyne, NE99 1AL. That's Crosswits, Tyne Tees Television, P.O. Box 1AL, Newcastle upon Tyne, NE99 1AL.